Hello everyone, I'm Mr. Lopez for Replay Review and today I'm gonna talk about a, a game for the Nintendo Switch I'm gonna talk about Repeat Adventure That's why I'm all sweaty, I was playing just now I'm gonna talk about uh, what's working well from the game, what could be better and uh, my overall rating um, before you watch this, I'm gonna ask you, if you don't want to hear this, just skip it uh, Click on the subscribe button, click on the like, it helps me, it adds some features in my YouTube channel which makes everything easier, so just click on it um, And that's it, let's review this uh, in the words of the most uh, famous Mario brother Let's -a go! So the first thing that I think it's really good about this game is that it feels like a game. Uh, when you're playing, you're, it's an RPG game, so you are involved in this history. The history is not that great, it's very basic, but it's, you're involved and you're working out without really noticing. I had a couple of times that I actually got beat by this dragon I was like well, I'm not gonna get killed by this stupid animal so I went back and I did the level again just because because I'm a gamer and I want I, I'm playing it because I want to play a game not because I want to work out I think that's really cool it, it has a lot of uh, it has a main adventure and then it has a lot of mini games built into the adventure or uh, games that you can play uh, apart from it it has a lot of different um, characters and because it, it it works as a RPG, you get XP from some of them, you get more coins from other of them, the uh, enemies are really well developed, they're these anamorphic, uh, I don't know if anamorphic is the right word, these shapes from gyms that are turned into anthropomorphic, that's the word, that they're turned into enemies and they have eyes and they have arms and all of these. Uh, you build your skills as you go along uh, and you actually get a, an opportunity to build your skills according to your preferences, which I think is really good. So if you want to focus on just your arms and you want to unlock some uh, some qualities or some skills, it's up to you, which feels like a game. In the same way that in, uh, in any other RPG game, you're building your skills and you're deciding what route to take and if you're focusing more on one side or another. Uh, and I think that's really good. You have potions, uh, which are coming to a, the way of smoothies, but it is, it feels like a game and that's fantastic. The second really good thing about this game is that it's highly motivating. It's always pushing you to succeed and it's really encouraging and it's cheering you. Uh, the voice of the character, Ring, is uh, really energetic and it's full of these... He, he wants to see you succeed. So he's pushing you and it's always telling you how well you're doing and it tells you that your sweat is so shiny and beautiful. And it, it's... It's really like really nice to be listening to this uh, while you're working out. Uh, it praises the amount of uh, repetitions that you've done across the your, the time that you've been playing. Uh, it, you have a victory pose at the end of uh, each level, so it's really motivational and it's uh, focused on your achievements, which is really really positive. Another thing that is really good about this game is that it feels like it cares about you. Uh, it constantly asks you uh, how you're feeling, if you if the difficulty is the right level for you, if you want to check your pulse to make sure that everything's fine. Um, it reminds you uh, time to get some water. So it cares uh, about you physically as a human and then it cares about you as a character as well. Uh, so it sometimes it tells you, oh, you're losing hearts or maybe you need to take a potion or something. It asks you when you've been working out for a certain amount of time, it will ask you if you want to take a break. Uh, it would ask you or suggest to do a cool down after you've worked out. Um, the cooldown is normally uh, set for the specific 
uh, parts that you've been working out that day and it gives you tips at the end of each workout which I think one of the things that I love about the tips is that they're grounded it, it's not pretending to be something that it's not it tells you like the reality is that you're probably not gonna get really muscular but it will keep you fit and on a personal note I am amazed by the uh, the work of this video game I never thought that I was gonna get a toned playing a game and it's impressive to actually see results and see that I have lines in my apps never thought that I would have especially not by playing a video game so that's fantastic it's really really amazing now there are some things that I think could be better uh, the first thing is uh, it will be really good if you could actually unlock more things I, th I think the game is a fantastic game it's really good uh, but it feels like they they were trying just to sort out the uh, the technical aspects and making sure that it would work with the video game and it does now I, what i would love to to see is nintendo coming out with a second version of this game which is even better like let me uh, unlock new things let me uh, unlock you have a victory post at the end of each level or each course so let me unlock victory poses I don't want to do the same victory pose every time like and I'm not saying just give them to me for free make me work for them you know the same uh, you grind for well you don't grind you just get some uh, materials that you need to craft your sportswear which is basically your armor I would love if I could if there was a way to have an open a world map where you need to grind certain types of monsters to get some materials to build your armor or to build your weapons and to make it even more like a game and i'm not saying give me the stuff i'm saying make me work for it make me do more exercise to get items to get materials to get those unlockables that I want like uh, any gamer wants the unlockables or trophies so give me those things give me quests give me more things to do and to grind uh, another thing that I think could be better is the animations uh, the animations is specifically for when you're fighting so if you chose if you're doing the bow pull why, why am I seeing fist uh, dropping down on monsters. Can I not see arrows from my bow? Can I not get a, a, a bow that looks like a Link bow? You know, like, can I not unlock these things and actually see animations that look like that? Not a, like a giant torso falling into the enemy. I think if they could work into these aspects for the second version of Reap it would be just fantastic. Now, there are a lot of different skills, a lot of different exercises that you can do in this game uh, and you actually get to select which ones you want to play. But what I've been finding is that sometimes it's uh, tiring to having to set the tasks, the, not the tasks, the skills every level because maybe today I feel like working out with a different exercise, maybe one that I haven't done in a while. And it would be really good if you could set like your skill um, sets like to have presets already there uh, that you make during the adventure mode because then i can just go and think okay i want to focus on legs today not that i'm gonna but like i could i could say like oh you know what i haven't done x and y exercises to, uh, in a while so i can just select that set and do them today uh, because otherwise it feels like i'm doing the same things over and over just because i'm lazy and i don't want to go into the skills and select them because it, it takes too long so if, if you could personalize that and make it a easier and faster for the user will be really good and i think the last thing uh, that i think could be better is the cooldown the cooldown is good but what i've found in, i've been playing uh, this game for 93 days something like that just now uh, and sometimes i just play adventure and after you play adventure the cooldown is focused on the the things that you did during the adventure mode which is great for that 
but sometimes every adventure and I want to work a bit more so I uh, go out from that and I do a set or I go to custom uh, and I do some other exercises. When that happens I don't have a chance to do cool down so that I feel like I need to do cool down because it's I know it's good for you it, it's healthier uh, but then I don't have an opportunity to just go into the menu and do a cool down based on everything that I've done uh, so if you could get that and your stretching there, that option that will be uh, really good for the users as well. Now for my overall rating, this is the first review that I do for anything, so I don't know how to give it a score. I don't, I feel like when you give a number, it's just it, like each person has a different structure of numbers in the hair. So what I would give to this game is two flex emojis and one cool emoji. I think it's a really good game. Uh, it makes you work out without noticing that you're working out, which I think it's fantastic. For me, that's like the, the go-to. Uh, I feel healthier since I've been playing. I've been playing for uh, 93 days of game. I started in January. I started playing just once a week and then it actually made me want to do more because it was a game and I wanted to unlock things and I, all of these. So it's a really good game. It makes me feel healthier, which I am honestly surprised. I never expected a video game to make me feel as healthy and trying to make me drink more water just because it feels as the right thing to do. I never expected this to happen with a video game. Uh, so it's really good. Uh, would I recommend this to someone? Yes, I would. Totally, I've been recommended to some friends because it's like a video game, it's fun, it keeps you healthy. Uh, could it be better? Yes, but it's fantastic. I like my, what I would love is for Nintendo to do Ring Fit Adventure 2, which is better, bigger, bolder, brighter, everything. It is a good game. I hope that they uh, keep the franchise and that they build it up because it's really good. And that's it. Um, again, click on the like button, click on subscribe. This just helps me to create more content. It, it unlocks things that are, it makes everything easier. Um, and that's us for now. Thanks for watching. I'm Mr. Lopez. See you next time. Bye bye. Drop your hips. Straight.